toi Tu m'as pas montré le chemin Avant toi Je n'avais rien Avant toi On ne m'a pas montré le chemin Je sais le ciel Ne m'en veux pas D'avoir posé les yeux sur toi All right, good morning, good morning everyone. Bonjour, bonjour à tous. Uh, habari, habari gani from Kenya and Tanzania. Walalapo from Namibia and from Uganda. How do we say from Uganda? Masu Zotia. And from Rwanda, I can see people from Rwanda, Maramute. What other country? From Nigeria and Ghana. How do we say that? We say Oga, Oga. I don't know. Okay, all right. Uh, good morning. So uh, welcome to today's stand-up. We are starting stand up. This is day four, week one, of course. Uh, welcome to UTJ stand up. I hope while well, you're all doing well, as always, this is our chance to catch up on everyone's progress, address any technical challenge in case you have maybe any challenge, any question, anything that you might be facing, and of course, share important updates and announcements. So, uh, before we start and uh, go quick around, uh, for everyone, I would love maybe if you can just do a catch up of yesterday. How was yesterday? Yeah, of course, yesterday we didn't have that much. A lot, uh, we had a stand up, but the stand up we had community building session, it was amazing. I loved the attendance. Then we had um, the three tutorial data analysis techniques, then the challenge work. Of course, yesterday it was a challenge submission, uh, submission day. So yeah, the photo was open yesterday, so you can see our submit it today. Uh, then today we have stand up, which is this one. Then uh, day four tutorial creating dashboards in Google Data Studio. Then community building session and independent challenge work. So that's it actually today. And uh, before we start, maybe we have Makira. Do you want to say anything? Maybe. Um. Uh, hi everyone uh, and yeah I'm just happy that you guys are here it's um, day four of the week and yesterday was interim solution so I'd like just to hear about uh, the progresses that you made if you have uh, submitted the interim submission how was it and yeah just wanted to hear that amazing yeah I remember from period we also had a discussion session yesterday as well Thank you so much, Kirod. Yeah, so uh, let's go around and maybe hear from everyone's progress. If you have any question, maybe any update, anything you love to say, you can just open your mic and, and say it. Uh, for people who are unable to speak, maybe we understand you might be in a place where you are unable to speak, you can always share the chat box in case you have any update or any question. Uh, we have Kirod with us, uh, and we'll be assisting with the question. So if you're ready, you can just raise a hand, then we follow the queue. Okay, we have Elvis so far. I basically go ahead as we wait more. Um, what, what I would like to, to say is that it will be nice if um, we can get kind of the uh, I'm not sure if I got you, Elvis. Uh, you, kind of break it. you can break it. Okay. Uh, Elvis, if you're speaking, we can hear you. Maybe you can share in the chat box. Yes, I'll send it back. All right, amazing. Uh, do you have anyone else to share their progress so far? It's the first week, and this, okay, sorry, I. I guess there's more updates from you. Okay, we have 
Bernard Coffee. Do you read your name, Bernard or Bernard? It's French in Bernard and Bernard in, in English. I don't know how it should be. You can go ahead, Bernard. Okay, thank you very much. I don't know if you can hear me. Good morning. Yeah, yeah. Good morning. Okay, so um, basically, um, I just wanted to, regarding the tasks that we submitted, um, mine was basically about um, the data cleaning session. But first of all, the, um, during the charting, um, I was hoping that the various uh, emissions will come with the colors that was indicated. But I realized that my chart um, mostly is like one color, or I was expecting that the emissions will have different colors on the chart. That's one challenge. And then um, regarding the data itself, um, I was trying to um, uh, fill up the gaps in it, and I was finding challenges, especially because I wanted to use the uh, the mean mode that like um, to be able to calculate the mean and then fill in the gap. But I realized that um, the spaces were a lot, so um, that's where I had some little challenge. And then the cleaning stuff, um, I tried to remove the duplicate, but I was told that um, I think there wasn't any duplicate like that. And um, but when I highlight and then I try to do it, it gives me a shorter version of the data. But when I highlight it and then I, I get the full data, so it was a bit confusing. But I tried to submit something just to measure progress as well. And then on on the business uh, the business understanding, I wasn't really clear what um, you wanted. I don't know whether you wanted our understanding of um, what the business is about or the uh, the tax at hand. So it was really not really clear to me at that point. Your mic is muted. I couldn't oh, hear you okay. if you can speak. Okay, you can go ahead, Carol. Please. Okay, uh, I was just, just saying that. Yeah, okay, let me try to uh, just answer uh, Bernard's question. So, I believe the first question was that uh, all of the uh, charts line were the same color. Am I right, Bernard? Yeah, exactly. Yeah, okay. So Although you can't on the, change on the legend, you see that the colors were there for the various emissions. On the legend, it shows, but on the chart itself, I saw that it was like the same color. Okay, so maybe you can share your screen and we can uh, just go through them on the session, or we can do it now. Uh, let me try and see if I can share, I can share the, the what I did. Let me let me try and see if I can share the screen. Okay. Uh, we can see your screen, but uh, I, I believe you're using your phone. Uh, okay. In the meantime, uh, let me just answer this question. So, feedback will be uh, will be given to you once the grading is completed. So you can check uh, your Tenex account for that. But we will not be sending emails uh, for feedbacks of your submissions. But every sub submission will have a feedback. Uh, or uh, uh, there will be two kinds of feedback. There, there will be um, okay. 
maybe in Mak Makta? Yeah. I was just uh, going to say that you'll be given uh, feedback regarding your interim submission and also final submissions. So, um, uh, the, so you have a 48 hour grace time until you submit both your submissions. So that means now uh, there's the interim submission and on Saturday there's the final submission. You'll have two days until then, which is until Sunday. And then so feedback will be given around next week, Thursday for this week. And the feedbacks are not going to be through email, but on your Tenex. Can you see my screen now? Yeah, yeah, I can. Can you zo zoom in a bit? Yeah. Yeah, so the problem here is, uh, so if you can, uh, if you remember your data sets, uh, the datas are, have very much, uh, let's say, um, difference in, measurements right so uh, for instance the ozone is measured with higher numbers and the others are measured in lower numbers so that's why you cannot see uh, the rest of the measurements here you are only seeing the ozone measurements because they are much more higher than the rest okay 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 yeah. okay all right okay thank you okay um and for your second question yeah, for integration, we had a session yesterday afternoon. If you weren't part of it, um, we would encourage you to look at the videos, or of course, we can go through them again. But uh, basically, what we were trying to do was trying to impute uh, the new value into the columns of the data set. So you can check that out, and uh, or we can have a discussion about it. So if you still have the problem, we can have a discussion about it later. Okay, I will. And um, uh, I, I, I'm sorry, I missed your uh, third question. Can I, could you repeat it? Okay, so I wanted to understand, uh, you were asking about the business understanding uh, and the outline for the submission, the intern. So I wanted to understand what you wanted from us when you meant what you meant by business understanding. Okay, okay, good question. Uh, so the business understanding is just what you understand about the, the objective of this week's challenge. So it could mean, uh, so for this week, you are, uh, your company needs uh, to relocate to Africa. So uh, it has some certain goals and you want, uh, you want, it wants you, the operational uh, manager, I believe, uh, to just go to the, the cities and go to the data of the cities and come up with a recommendation of a city that has, that fits into the goals of the company, right? So, the business understanding is what you understand that you need to do and what do you understand about the scenario. Okay, all right, thank you. Okay, you're welcome. Uh, Collins, I believe you had your hand raised. Collins, if you see have a question, you can go ahead. And uh, from the chat box, uh, Jonathan, uh, the discussion video will be on YouTube shortly. Uh, I'll be checking and get back to you shortly. Uh, I guess maybe calling. Yes, Jonathan? Jonathan, you can go ahead. Since calling is not speaking. Jonathan, then uh, my other. In case you're speaking, you're not and we can't hear you. Okay. okay. Uh, can you hear me? Yes. Okay. Okay. Uh, so I didn't hear when my killer thought I had a question about feedback. I want to know if we will get feedback. Uh, that um, help us on the process. 
I'm not sure you when. Get, I'm not getting you well. You can't break me. Like you can't get to you. I don't know if you can catch to you. Uh, no, uh, same here. Thank you. Would you mind repeating yes? I said that I wrote to you. I didn't hear when Nakida talked about feedback. Feedback. So I want to know if we we get feedback on the submission team submission that can help us in the process. Oh, okay. About the feedback, uh, you get the feedback on ten nights, and uh, maybe Makida can share more about that. Okay, Rod, do you help maybe? Makida, are you there? Um, yes, but I didn't hear you. Yeah, it's about the feedback. Uh, oh, it's about oh the feedback. So as I said earlier uh we will have to get their final submission as well to give feedbacks so grading will happen next week starting uh monday uh, until wednesday and uh, on thursday we'll be uh sending out feedbacks on tenix amazing thank you uh does it help my are we good now okay it's okay thank you amazing thank you so much okay. Uh, Bernard, you can go ahead. Okay, thank you. Sorry, I had to come in again. Uh, you know, I tried to also import my data from uh, the site uh, uh, using the link. Um, I was successful though, but then it wasn't showing. It's it's loaded. It wasn't really showing on the um, on the sheet. So I wanted to know if there's something I did wrong or there's something I'm supposed to do. So it the process went through, picked the link, and then. Uh, did all the necessary sessions and then it indicated it was loading but then once it's done it doesn't really pop up show on the on the sheet okay sorry for the challenge uh Kerod. yeah uh, so this would be better if you could share your screen and uh, we can do it together because uh, i believe there is tough uh, then it's said successfully. So if you can share your screen and we can go through it either together, that would be better. If we can, if you can't, we can just uh, write on Slack and when you are, whenever you're ready and we can do it together. Okay, thank you. Let me try and see if I can get it on the laptop okay. then whilst yeah, this discussion goes on. Okay, okay. Amazing, thank you. Uh, do we have more questions or more updates from people here before we wrap up? I think we still have some minutes, we still have some time, so if there's more challenges, more questions, you can raise it. Yes, Abby, Samson. Yeah, uh, thank you. My question is, uh, I cannot be able to see the second challenge uh, to work on Tenex. So maybe uh, you can post it and we'll send next assignment. Um, so the second assignment will be open uh, on Saturday because the submission date is on Saturday. But we will make sure to announce even if we open it on Friday. So yeah, and for the okay. career submission, uh, it will be open on Friday. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. Uh, so, but, but before we move on, Abby, uh, have you finished all the task of uh, challenge one, the week one challenge? Yeah, yeah, yes. Okay, 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 amazing. Thank you so much. Um, we have Collins back. I think maybe you left the call, but before you left the call, you, you had a question. Collins, you can hear me. It is Collins. Good, good day. Yes, uh, you had a question before. Mm -hmm. Yes, uh, I've been facing some network challenge. I wanted to ask um, 
Uh, the the first thing is, uh, sorry, I just want to first is I want to understand. Uh, I think when uh, Makida was explaining and uh, about the submission, I know it's Saturday, you know, for me, 9 uh, p.m. to 9 p.m., but he's talking about something so I didn't really get that. Uh, whether there's an extension for Sunday, maybe if she can repeat, I'll be able to understand that better and then uh, uh, secondly is uh, on the task one where we have the air, air quality um, uh, no uh, on the task two uh, where we're supposed to uh, you know check for uh, uh, cost of living and all that so for some you know on the site some are not complete that's my experience anyway so some of the data i need is not complete on that site so you have a lot of question mark question mark so probably that was not gotten that was not uh, captured in the site for the city i have chosen some are complete some are not so it was a bit difficult for me to uh, relate with that i don't know if i can be assisted Amazing. Thank you. Uh, sorry for the challenges. Uh, about the feedback, what, maybe, like, are you here? Yeah, but um, yes. the feedback, what Makita was saying. Yeah, okay. So you, you can go ahead, Makita. Um, so was the question that why we're not opening the um, submission earlier? No, I think he just wanted you to repeat. He didn't get it. He just joined. I guess. No. Yeah. My question is what, what you were talking about an extension to Sunday, something like that. I, I didn't really get what oh. you meant there. Oh, okay. So we uh, we accept late submission until 48 hours after the actual submission time. So on your 10x onboarding, there's a late uh, submission policy. When you look at that, we accept submissions that are late until 48 hours after the submission time, after, after the deadline. That's what I meant. Oh, oh, okay, but this extension, does it count for the, the leaderboard? Leaderboard, oh, it's just... Uh... It's for all the submissions, for engine submission and also final submission. So we recommend that you submit your assignments on time. But if you can't and you're late, we accept it until 48 hours after the actual demo. OK, OK, fine. I understand. Yeah. OK. Amazing. Thank you so much. Um, for the next question, uh, Kerwood, maybe if you yeah. go ahead. Yeah, okay. Uh, so, uh, so we we have provided two sites, and uh, whenever there is, you, you can find a course on one site, you can find it on the other. Plus, for the four cities that you are required to fetch the data, most of the courses are available. So, uh, maybe check for uh, on both sites, and if Okay, we lost you. Okay, we lost you in case you're speaking in your network. Hello, can everyone else hear me? Yeah, yeah, I, I can hear you, but uh, I yeah, didn't I, hear what uh, Carol Carol did. Yeah, I think he's having uh, issue with the internet. Maybe he will come back. But yeah, uh, for your question, maybe you can even reach him on on Slack. If he easily assist you as well, right? Are you okay, that okay. like on Slack? Text him. I also uh, let him know. That uh, you're testing or you can text you yeah 
Uh, all right. So Amazing. Okay. Uh, we had testify. I saw testify raise the hand. Do you want to ask? It's fire. I don't remember the next name, but um, I saw you. Oh, are we good? It's fire. I think it's fire. Okay. Um, yeah. Yeah, I think I lost my connection there. Uh, did you hear me or shall I? Shall I go through it again? Yeah, yes, can, can please go to it again. I didn't get okay. Uh, yeah, I was just saying that we have provided two sites, right? Two websites that you can check the costs. So if you cannot find uh, the cost on one site, you can find it on the other. Plus, for the four cities that you are required to just uh, find or analyze, the costs are mostly available on both sites. So just make sure to do that. And if you still have the problem, you can just uh, write on Slack and I will help you. All right, sir. thank you. Hello, I guess I lost, lost you. Hello, yeah, is, yeah. We, uh, we you know. yeah. Amazing. yeah, I just answered your question. Yeah, yeah. Uh, amazing, amazing. Thank you. So we still have three, two minutes. Uh, if there's still someone maybe with a question or a challenge, we can still uh, help. But maybe in the case there's nothing, in case there's no one, uh, we can wrap up. Maybe for more questions on Slack, we'll be able to, to assist you. Is there maybe anyone left with a challenge? Okay, I guess not. Uh, do you have maybe any announcements from the team, Makita or Um, Yes, I do have an announcement. So uh, I was checking uh, some of the submissions uh, on Phoenix, and almost most of them didn't uh, have access. So I would like to ask the trainees to give access to the tutors uh, so that uh, we can uh, check it. Uh, yeah, so that's all. And if you can, uh, maybe if it's possible, if you can make uh, your name on Google and your name on Slack the same, we can easily identify Facebook so that we can give Amazing, and I think we have something in the chat box as well before we we, we end. And Bernard is presenting to solve the other issue. Then we wrap up that. Gerard, if you can check in the chat box, I think that's for you. Uh, as I shared, uh, like yesterday, Claude was present data analysis techniques, and lastly, he presented examples using some techniques. Can I get that example, please? Carol, this is for you. Yeah, okay. Uh, I think we are talking about the Excel example, the Excel sheet. Mm -hmm. If so, I will, yeah, I will provide it. Nice. All right, uh, over to you again, I think, with Bernard. OK, so I'm trying to go through to see uh, what I can tell you about. Okay.
in the meantime, Paul, do you have a, like a question or you want to comment on this? Paul, I can see your hand raised. Okay, so this comment, is what I did. If you have a question. And then I allow access. Okay, okay uh, can so you, I, I yeah. It, it, yeah, I get it now. Thank you. Amazing. From Pulsey. Um, Pausi, do you want to ask? Uh, I can see something in the chat box. Can I use SQL, uh, Kerod? Um, so, do you want to answer that? So, you can use queries, uh, advanced queries in the sheets. So, that's possible, but we just want you to be comfortable with Excel. And that's why we're using uh, the Google Sheets. But if you are more comfortable with using MySQL, and so on, you can, but uh, that's more advanced than this one. But if you want to use SQL on Excel, you can use the advanced query. I believe we had a session yesterday on how to use that, so yeah, you can. Uh, Emilian? Oh, oh yeah, yeah. Yeah. sorry, sorry. I was just saying bye. Like, thank you so much. In case there's more maybe questions after, you, you can always reach us on, on Slack. And thank you so much for joining today and have a good day. Bye, everyone. Bye bye. Yeah. yeah. Remember, remember to rename your name on Slack, either on Slack or on Google Meet. As Kiro said, uh, it's kind of confusing. Like we can know who is this and who is this. So just update your names on Google Meet, on Google, and then on Slack as well. Yeah, that's it. Bye.